Hello, my beautiful friends, and welcome to Tailor Made Beauty by Chris. Today, I've got a short video for you on what I'm going to purchase during the, what they're calling the Sephora-thon, where it's 30 days in December, where you get various incentives to buy stuff from them. And honestly, the only one I'm interested in is going on uh, from December 3rd through the 9th, so you still have a couple of days to take advantage of it. If you're VIB Rouge, they've given us $25 off a purchase of $75 or more, which works out to 33 and a third percent off, which is pretty gosh darn good. If you are VIB, you get $20, and I'm quickly bringing up my calculator to do that math. That is 26.7% uh, off, so still really good. And if you are a beauty insider, you get $15 off. Again, that's off a $75 purchase, and that's 20% off. So really uh, good deals if you stick as closely as you can to that $75 without going under. I am not buying much makeup at all these days. I find it a chore to even put on when no one's going to see it, or if they do, it's only going to be my eyes because everything else is under a mask. So my Sephora list is pretty short and pretty specific. I really like the Marc Jacobs the uh, the gel eyeliners, what do they officially call them? They officially call them the Highliner Gel Eye Crayon. And there are three of them that I am interested in getting. One is the color Irony, number 45. That is a dark gray, and I own that one already, so this would be a replacement. There is a matte brown called Earthquake that I'm also looking at. And the last one is a limited edition called Glitter Sweet. And it looks like it's more, uh, looks like there's quite a bit of orange in this brown, something a little lighter. So those are the three that I'm looking at. I was also going to get the Sephora Lip scrubber. This is a silicone brush that you can uh, use to scrub your lips. This time of year uh, I tend to get chapped lips, dry lips, and that would be nice to help um, alleviate that, that loose skin you get, which is very unpleasant. I see right now it's out of stock, so we'll have to see whether it comes back in stock or not. The only other thing I would consider buying from Sephora right now um, are the Olaplex hair products. I recently bought some of the, um, the leave-in conditioners, leave-in treatments that are supposed to help repair the bonds of your hair, help hold moisture in. I know it's the number three. I think it's the number one and the number three. I'm gonna pop the picture here and I'll show you exactly which ones uh, I've been liking. Uh, but it's going to be an either or because either one of those is going to bring me really close to that 75. Marc Jacobs, those eyeliners are 26 bucks, so three of them come out to $78. That's spot on. That lip scrubber for comes back in is 10 bucks, and the Olaplex stuff. It just depends on what you're getting. So that's what I'm doing. The other offers, uh, the week two, starting December 10th, says that it's Fenty and Beauty and Gucci. Apparently there are some new releases coming there. Week uh, two, also December 10th through 6th, you get a point. It's their point multiplier event. Rouge, you get 4x points. VIB, 3x. Insider, 2x. So what? Their points program sucks. <laughs> uh, December 17th is new fragrance launches. And um, let's see, December 19th is a chance to win a gift card. And then the last week, which runs December 20th through January 1, is a sale on the sale. So all the stuff that they put on sale will be an additional 20% off. And every time I look through that stuff they put on sale, most of it's crap. 
there you go. Thank you so much for joining me. Subscribe, ring the bell, have a great day.